This is The Lockpicking Lawyer, and today I am continuing my series of videos testing various bike locks against my 18-inch hydraulic cutters. Today's lock is the Kryptonite Keeper 12U lock. This lock, or a variant of it, has been a mainstay of the Kryptonite lineup for decades, and it may be one of the most ubiquitous designs in the US. Now, I previously featured this lock in video number 735, where I demonstrated what it takes to pick into it. If you're interested in seeing that video, I'll leave a link to it in the description below. But today, we're going to see how this lock's 12mm hardened steel shackle holds up against these hydraulic cutters. So, let's head down to the garage and see what happens. Okay, we're down in the garage, and it bears note before we start that this is a lock with a shackle that only secures into the body on one side. As such, if we cut it on this side, we are guaranteed that a second cut will not be necessary. So let's get these into the jaws and start cutting. Okay, let me zoom in just a little bit to give you a better view. Okay, we're back upstairs, and as you saw, this lock was no match for the hydraulic cutters. Like last time, the cut required relatively little force on the pump handle, indicating to me that we have plenty of power to spare. If we zoom in on the cut, you can see that the blades went roughly two-thirds of the way through the shackle before the shackle failed. That, in combination with the relatively unscathed cutter blades, suggests that the shackle is considerably softer than the blades. That's something I don't expect to hold true as we start investigating higher-end products. In any case, that's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.